Hi friends, I am Manish Pandey. Welcome back. In this video, we are going to learn how to enhance UiPath Clipboard AI by adding a custom extraction model and you will also learn how to use it to extract the data from a document type that is not listed by default in Clipboard AI. So let's get started. I'm going to show you how to add extraction model in UiPath Clipboard AI. Our agenda will be why adding a custom exception model in UiPath Clipboard AI. How to add an extraction model in UiPath Clipboard AI for a custom document type and test the UiPath Clipboard AI with the new document type. So in UiPath Clipboard, if we'll open this settings, you see here one option, we have extraction model. So I will show you how to add here the another model, the extraction model so that you can use it. To explain this and show you, I have one document that is payslip. Okay. I want to copy this payslip data, this information and then paste into the Excel file. So I'll go to this, click on copy window. Now copy to clipboard AI. Now I need to paste this data. So I'll open this Excel file. And then I will go click on paste in Excel. Now click on paste in Excel. Now very soon mapper will be opened here. And then you can see here, we can verify. Okay, as you can see here, the extractor model selected as a universal extractor. Okay, so let's say if I'm going with this one, so if we'll click on paste, so it's going to paste the data here. Okay, now it's pasting the data in a sequence, right? In one row it has entered the data. But if you want the data in a, some different way, let's say you want like the name and all these details here and you want uh, this earnings and all this amount you want here, right? Then you will have to go with the custom extraction model. Uh, this July details uh, basically we should add here in the July pay slip. So data we are going to paste uh, here. Now every time we'll have a separate sheet for every month and then we need to enter the details same as this like this we'll paste here. So if you need to capture that way then we'll have to extract using the pay slip extraction model. And if we'll go here click on paste in Excel and then you will see the mapper click on change now here you can see we do not have pay slip here right UiPath clipboard AI is designed to work with specific document types like invoices passport ID card receipts purchase order resume utility bills and more but sometimes you might need to extract the data from a document that is not listed let's say this pay slip then you will have to go with the extraction model so if you see here click on settings extraction model click on add another model now here we need to enter the URL for that specific the custom document type model now I need pay slip so I have to search here go to the browser and search here UiPath document understanding endpoints URL. This you have to search. And then you can open this one public endpoints. So this extraction model is part of document understanding. Now let's scroll down. You can see public endpoints. And you need to search for that specific document you need. So we have invoices for different different uh, country. Also, we have Japan, China. We have receipts, purchase order, utility bills, ID cards, passport, pay slip. Now we have pay slip here. So what you need to do? You need to just simply copy this URL and then go to this UiPath clipboard and paste here. Click somewhere else. Then we will get this API key field enabled. Now we need to enter the API key. From where we'll get API key? 
So come to the UiPath Orchestrator, click on this one, click on Admin. This UiPath RP underscore org, this organization is selected. Now click on License. Now click on Robot and Services. We have this document understanding. Copy this API key. Go to this extraction model. Paste here that API key. Okay, and click somewhere else. And then this will sync with that specific URL, endpoint URL. Now it's asking you to enter the OCR URL, OCR API key, type and name. Now OCR URL and API key is optional. No need to add here. From the type, if you have pay slip, you can choose. Otherwise, you can select other and you can type here pay slip. Okay. Now click on save. So this has been added. Now if we'll, let, let me open this settings again. You can see we have added this pay slip extraction model. This is the URL and this is the API key, right? If you need to add another, you can add another and you have to do follow the same things. Now let's close this. Now go to the pay slip. We'll try to extract again. So copy window. Okay. Now go to the Excel and this time let's create another sheet so that I can show you how it's going to extract and paste the data. Now let's click on paste in Excel. Once mapper will be opened, we need to change that extraction model. So by default, it has taken universal extracted that is in the preview mode. We need to change this to the specific one. So earlier the pay slip was not there. Now we have added that. So we'll click on pay slip. Once we'll click on pay slip, this specific document, this section will be selected. Now, again, it's going to identify and get the data from there. You can see now our records is like this way. Employer name details, everything is showing here. And then we have uh, these details in the four columns, four rows in the table. Okay. Now we'll paste here. And now you can see here how this pay slip extraction model has been designed. To extract the data okay so we have employer name address employee name the payment date employee title paid days total earnings total deduction net amount this has been added on the top in the row and these four added in a table here you can verify here So this way we have basic pay. So same same way in the table that we have here in pay slip that has been added here, right? After that, if you want, you can do it like this. You can um, you can form it as a table. Okay. Now you can see here we have earnings, earning amount, that this amount, deduction and deduction amount. This one. And everything has been captured and pasted here in a good manner in the right format. We have copied the data from pay slip and pasted here in Excel file. Thank you for watching this video. I hope this video helped you understand how to add extraction model in UiPath Clipboard AI and how to use it with a custom document type. If you found this video helpful, please like, share and subscribe. If you have any question or suggestion, feel free to leave them in comments below. Until next time. Happy learning.